are all persons of interest in this case. Someone's trying to frame this. This is gonna be fine. Could be bad. It's very rare for a true crime podcast to do a sequel. We have a real opportunity here. Does anyone else feel like there's still a couple of loose ends? Get a new hobby, as long as it doesn't land you in jail. Like knitting? All right, don't be a smart ass. It's kind of her thing. We are looking for new evidence. You clearly know things that you're not sharing. You understand the definition of perjury? I know what perjury is. I don't. Our lives blow up if we all go down for this. Don't you want to clear your name, too? I have to see this through. Let's focus. I'll be right back. Well, you can't leave me here. I'm that good at parties. Oh, hi. I'm, I'm nervous to talk to people because I can come off creepy. <laughs> keeps showing up in our apartments. Who's ever doing this is toying with us. This ends the investigation and to a whole new direction. We hope it will take us to clues. It's a wall. And suspects. So what do we know about my daughter's murder? Maybe she killed Bunny. You think that woman stabbed someone eight times? We'll put a pin in her for now. Isn't this fun? As you can see, we're on fire. Deep breaths. We have two options. I slap you across the face, or we just skip to the part where you say, thanks, kid, that was tough to hear. Uh, not the slapping one. You need to go full Ollie Mabel here. What? Ollie Mabel. All our names put into one. Where is the Charles in Ollie Mabel? The Charles is silent. 